Hey guys, so we'll be um, reacting to another song. This one's by a band called In Chaos. So, yeah. Um, don't know much about this band at all, actually. I think they're from Japan or something, but that's about it. I just had a look on the Dreambound records. Um, see what was on there. So this was one of the ones I found on there. So I thought I'd try and review this one. So try and react to this one and review it. So let's, oh yeah, before we get into it, I've got PayPal down, down in the description if you want to click on that, support me on that. Also be going live on my other channel later. So if you haven't subscribed to that, then um, go ahead and click the, there'll be a link to that as well. So um, it's not about music, but if you want to check that out, then go ahead. Anyway. So let's get into this, shall we? Okay. Let's just make sure. All right, let's press play.
Yeah, quite nice. Uh, yeah. So yeah, the Japanese. Um, but yeah, I didn't really think you got a lot of those, those kind of bands from there. I mean, um, that that's kind of like. Um, I don't even know what you call it. Probably kind of, it's kind of a mix in a way. It's kind of mixed genres. Um, that's what I gathered. Um, sometimes it sounded like melodic hardcore, like when there was the screaming parts and the some of the guitar work sounded like that. And sometimes it sounded kind of yeah, really mellow. And then there was times where it, and then there was like the parts where she was singing, it kind of sounded a bit more like kind of, I don't know, just a kind of melodic kind of, um, I don't know what, like rock or whatever. I don't know. Um, and then there was this part with the guitars where it's like it kind of had this genty kind of um, like pr like progressive kind of vibe to it, like kind of like when you get some of the progressive metalcore type of bands, um, bands like Periphery, I suppose, could be kind of compared with. It's kind of had that kind of um, a little bit of technicality shown in it which kind of give it a bit of give the song a bit of diversity actually there's so yeah, so some different bits to it um but honestly I, with the vocals i mean I, I did like the vocals i thought they were nice and all that and then when the screamer came in i thought uh i don't know i i, I hear a lot of these bands where they have like two vocalists it's like i don't know i just find it a little bit i don't know a bit cliche in a way like there's so many bands that do that kind of stuff it's like i guess it works but i don't know um i just see so many do it like um like there's so like there was all these bands like uh what was it we came as Romans, uh, crowned the empire? All the, all these bands. It's just, uh, I don't know. But I suppose it's different because there's like a there's a female singer doing the clean vocals, and then there's a male doing the uh, more aggressive kind of vocals. Um, yeah. So I suppose it kind of adds a kind of dynamic to it which is um quite interesting in a way um yeah so i mean yeah it was pretty good i'd say um i mean all the instruments were pretty spot on i'd say there was some good like production going on i noticed like um yeah I, just, I think it was all around a pretty decent track but i'm not sure if i'd really kind of keep listening to it i don't know it's um yeah anyway so hope you enjoyed this so um leave a comment let me know what you think if you want to suggest a track um you can go ahead but i'm gonna be um yeah so if, if you want to support me on paypal then uh what will happen is if, if you tell me a track if i've not already listened to it i'll definitely review it i mean and, and react to it so yeah um so yeah make sure to like share s subscribe and 
comment if you haven't sub subscribe if you haven't already so yeah because it all helps to uh, grow the channel so yeah so yeah so thanks for watching and until next time peace out